Well, it's a much nicer start to the day as we were compared to yesterday. Yesterday was a little bit of a muggy and overcast start to the day, but today we're starting off with mainly clear skies. It's also much more cooler and refreshing. Now, we did pick up a little bit of some rain as we had through the day yesterday. We saw a few hit or miss showers in the morning, a few isolated downpours. And then we saw some more widespread downpours heading into the afternoon. In fact, we picked up anywhere between about half inch to almost an inch across the area. Westover reporting over an inch of rain as well. So we did pick up a little bit of a soaking, but nothing too, too bad, especially what we've seen over the last couple of weeks where we saw rain events picking up three, four, five inches of rain. But definitely a good soaking for your yesterday. Unfortunate timing it being on a weekend. But the good news is today a much nicer day. We're also starting off a bit on the cool and crisp side. Very October like temperature right now of 50 degrees. As we look out from our Agawam sky cam, we can see mostly sunny skies. Winds are coming in out of the southwest at nine miles per hour and take a look at that dew point. 43 degrees. It's about 20 degrees cooler than it was yesterday at this time in terms of the dew point. So it's not feeling nearly as muggy as it was yesterday morning. Now for your day today, we are going to be on tap for a good blend of sun and clouds. Highs will be getting into the upper 50s and lower 60s. I don't think we quite hit 63, but I would say closer to 60 is definitely not out of the question. And we are going to be on tap for some good sunshine. Now we do have an upper level low over the Great Lakes region, which could give us the chance for a spot shower as we head towards the afternoon. A lot of us will not see any rain and it will be dry for the most part for most of the day, but there is a low chance for a quick little pot passing downpour or isolated shower as we head towards the afternoon. Heading into the overnight hours will maintain mostly clear skies Some patchy fog might develop early tomorrow morning and temperatures will fall down into the lower to middle 40s and we are going to be on tap once again for another cool and crisp start to your day on Monday. Now as we take a look at our satellite and radar the wide view we had a cold front come through yesterday that brought us those showers and then behind that we turned breezy and clearer but this upper level low is still going to be lingering over our area for the next several days giving us a little bit of an unsettled pattern for most of next week where we'll start off most days with mostly clear skies and lots of sunshine. But then as we head into the afternoon, we do run the risk for a few passing hit or miss showers, and that's going to be the case today. As we could see a little bit of some energy spinning across port of the southern portion of this area of low pressure, kind of working its way into New England. We could see an isolated spot shower for the uh, afternoon hours today as well as the next several days. So right now we're, we're pretty much mainly clear. We do have some showers off to our west and a lot of that energy as it spins around the low pressure system might hit our area and we could see a quick shower. Now as we take a look at the future cast, we can see we're starting off today mostly clear. We do have a little bit of a breeze coming in out of the west and northwest. It's going to be on the breezy side today with winds occasionally gusting up to about 10 to 20 miles per hour up to perhaps even 25 miles per hour. Now heading into the afternoon, we do run the risk for an isolated spot shower, but again, a lot of us will not see any rain and it will be dry for most of the day. Heading into the overnight hours, we'll be looking at mainly clear skies. We'll start off tomorrow again with lots of sunshine. It will be a little bit breezy. And then we do run the risk for an isolated shower once again as we head into Monday afternoon. It's going to be kind of a repetitive pattern here where we start the day off with lots of sun. Most of the day will be dry and a lot of us will not see any rain, but the chance for a hit or miss shower is definitely not out of the question as well. So as we take a look at our upper level pattern, this is our area of low pressure that's going to be lingering over our area. And we can see that the jet stream is well off to our south, and that's going to be giving us the cooler and unsettled weather pattern for much of the week. In fact, the Climate Prediction Center has us trending well, a, a little bit wetter than normal for this time of year for the next several days or so as we take a look through the second week of October. And in terms of temperatures, we're going to be trending pretty much right where we should be for this time of year. Our average high is about 65 degrees, and we are going to be pretty much hovering right where we should be for this time of year with highs getting into the upper 50s and lower 60s. On the 10-day forecast, we'll see a blend of sun and clouds pretty much every day now through Friday, but we do have that low risk or an isolated spot shower. And then we are watching an area of low pressure, which could give us the chance for some soaking rain on the weekend once again, unfortunately, with highs in the 50s.